The show developed because it, it really takes a look at our, our progression uh, beyond the book as, as a source of, of information. We have things like iPads and Nooks, and it really gets us to question the life of a book and, and what's, it, what's its purpose. And so most of the artists that are in this exhibit reappropriate the book into something new and really give a new life to to the book. I mean, I've been looking at each one of these pieces individually, and when you see them come together and sort of have a dialogue between each other, I think that's what, what makes the exhibition really spectacular. Of course, the Mike Stilke piece behind me here was really fun because I it was a new piece, so I had no idea what it was actually going to be, so as we were stacking the books on top of each other, it was unveiling a new piece. The artists that were in attendance at the opening were new to Bakersfield and new to our museum, and I think they were surprised that Bakersfield has something like this, and I think they were very thrilled with the exhibition and uh, very complimentary on, on everything as a whole. I think this is something extremely unique, especially for, for Bakersfield. And you know, there's nine different artists that are in this exhibit that are outside of the area. Um, one of them is from Canada, Hawaii, um, and that we get to host this exhibit and, and highlight these artists from outside the area, I think is something really special. And also, I think it just gets you um, to, to really think about um, and question the life of the book and, and you know what happens in this, this very digital oriented world and um, it just you know causes you to um, pause and, and maybe look at the book in a different way. My part in this exhibition was um, mostly related to the installation of the show. Um, it was it was an experience like Christmas morning, where you know you're fairly unaware of what's actually arriving, um, the the issues that you might run into in terms of um, installation, and and really um, seeing these sculptures in images on the computer screen just does not do them justice. So um, it was really exciting for me to open up the packages and, and to help Vicki um, sort of plan the exhibition and lay it out and design it. Um, so that was probably the most exciting part. And of course, you know, any exhibition with three-dimensional work uh, is challenging to install because every artist, each of the nine artists, bring forth a new uh, set of challenges in terms of how their work needs to be displayed. Um, but this was truly a joy to install. It was a pleasure. This exhibit is very new in terms of, um, you know, sculptural exploration and reappropriating an object that um, we as a culture assign so much meaning to and so much importance to. Um, it's interesting to see the response from the community in general uh, about, you know, the, the so-called desecration of the book. Although in this case, I think that it's broadened the perspective of many of our community artists um, by presenting an opportunity um, to learn about process and materials that perhaps they hadn't thought about before or had been introduced to before. Um, you know, the, the idea of taking something discarded and creating something beautiful out of it and making it unique and special, again, is something that artists have been doing for centuries. Um, but again, in this day and age, we, we lose sight of what process and what materials are at hand and what we can do with those materials. Well, it was interesting to have, you know, some personal conversations with 
with the artists that attended the opening that are a part of this exhibition. Um, you know, we had, a, we had some funny horror stories about previous installations and the general response to the way that we presented their work here was um, very positive and, um, you know, they were very gracious in coming in, but excited at, say, excited to see the space and excited to see how we had designed the exhibition. I think that they were pleased with what they saw and um, and surprised, as Vicki said, to know that we have such a gem here in Bakersfield that they were unaware of.